A very warm welcome to Amaris, to my therapy room. I'm Anisis, I'm an Angels Reiki Grandmaster, Divinity Angels Reiki. I'm a Usui Grandmaster, that's Usui Reiki. And I'm a light healer, I'm a servant of the light, you could say, for over 25 years. So I'm, be, I'm very glad to have you here. And today I would like to, to explain you a little bit what is our soul garden temple activation. The divinity soul garden temple activation, what is it all about? Hmm? But you know, it is very important if possible, if you have not watched our soul garden video, better first to watch the soul garden video, soul garden healing, and because it will be easier to understand what is the temple activation. Hmm? So now the temple activation healing. It, it's very similar to the soul garden healing, but the difference is we focus on a topic. So for example, I say, you know, in my life always, I can't find the right husband. I did so much, but I just can't find the right husband, or I'm very unlucky in love, I'm unlucky with money, my career is not really progressing, I feel not protected, I would wish for children, I can't seem I still have no children. So clients have different life topics. Hmm? And then we would meet on Zoom, you will lie down, and I guide you again through the holy heart chakra with your guardian angel. I guide you into your soul garden, hmm? through your heart chakra. So and there you arrive in the soul garden. So now very similar to the soul garden healing, the divinity soul garden healing, again we go through the different healing experiences. Hmm? So we will arrive in the soul garden, receive the healing from our divine soul garden, then we will move on to our divine lake, Again, we will re receive a healing from our Divine Lake. We will go into the Divine Lake, be one with the Divine Lake, and receive the deep, deep healing. And then we will be carried by our Divine Guardian or by our Guardian Angel. We are carried to our Divine Waterfall. Again, we receive a wonderful healing. We will stand under the waterfall and receive this healing. And you know, different to a guided meditation here, I will hold the space and we will talk with each other. So I will talk with the client and together we will experience this soul garden healing. And from our divine waterfall, we are divinely guided and carried to the divine tree. And 
Hier an der Divine Tree will ich sie für deep, deep healing. And very often clients also receive messages from the tree. So it's all divinely guided and aligned to the divine will. And from the divine tree we are carried to our divine guardian, to the very sacred place of our divine guardian. Here first really we feel we become one with our guardian, again we receive a deep, deep healing and also the wisdom, what is really the right topic for our soul garden temple because sometimes it may be really different than what you planned for the session. So we will always listen, of course, to the divine guidance. Hmm? So this divine guardian after will show you this holy, sacred place and space where your temple shall be activated. So and then the divine shows us where our temple is or has to be. You know, sometimes the temple is already there and only needs to be activated. That means already in a past life we would have had really the skill, the gift of this temple. Or well, sometimes really the temple is not there yet and is really is being manifested by the divine. Hmm? And so here we will ask the divine to activate the temple for the topic we have chosen. It can be a relationship temple, a protection temple, a success temple, a abundance temple, a friendship temple. But you know, of course, there is this one divine law. We will never have a temple like to harm others. So the temple has to be to the highest good of our soul calling and to the highest good of creation. Then in a very special healing process, the Divine is really going to activate this temple. This means the light of the temple will first really enlighten the temple, then really start to spread the light into the soul garden. And from the soul garden, the light will go into our life. And the special thing, you know, if the temple is activated, it will stay activated even for future lives, as long it is to your highest good. Hmm? So after our, our temple is activated. We will give our thanks to all our divine guardians. And I will guide you back. I will guide my client back into his physical life, into this physical realm we are. Hmm? And you know, already within the first 21 days of the temple activation, really changes are taking place and really over the next three months, the next three years, really the topic will fully manifest and it's a life-changing healing and it's a, really a pure divine gift. 
But also there, the temple activation is not good as a first healing. Hmm? So much better first, if you are a new client, to have a light healing, then a soul garden healing, and then we will do the temple activation. Hmm? So I'm so happy you joined this video, and if you have any questions, please let me know and I also will take you now just for a short moment to our web page that you can see where you can read more to this topic. So here we have our Amaris Lightwork Academy web page and you know, please feel free, browse a little bit to our web page, look in the different healings, follow the, your divine guidance. And here you will find our Divinity Soul Garden Temple Activation Life Healing. So thank you so much and all the divine blessings and the loving, loving Sairam to you. From Anisis and from Amaris.